Hi guys, time to do some of those little cheap kits you get on eBay. I think I'm going to do that FM microphone. What have we got? Obviously no instructions, we don't want anything like that, do we? Microphone. Button cell holder. Transistor, only one. Three resistors, selection of little capacitors, just check they're all the same, 30, 30, 30, oh. Ten. Well, I can only see one written on that. Number sort of slipped off the side when they printed it. One o four, one o four. So that's going to be a process of elim elimination. On off switch, and a little coil. Right. Well, that's a good start. That says one oh three one oh four. That says one oh four. Okay, I might have to go online and just check the diagram. Because that's not good. Microphone seems fairly straightforward. Except we've got a plus and a minus. I have no idea which way round that goes. Right, well that doesn't help. I think we can work out which that is. <laughs> That's one I can do. I'll do the ones I can and then we might have to go and check online. Okay, one bit out of the way. Transistor. This is an 801, no, 8106 or a 9018. Which way round is that? 9018. Just remembered I usually zoom in when I'm doing this, don't I? Definitely 104, so that's definitely going to go there. That's definitely 104, so that's definitely going to go there.
need a 103 and a 30. Oh, that 30 is okay, isn't it? We've got plenty of them. Those two are both 30s. Ten written on it, so that must be that one. That's the only one that's left, so by elimination, unless they've given me the wrong one in the pack, it must be that one. Three resistors, one's 220 ohms, one's 2.2k, and one's 22k. Probably safest if I measure them. That looks like red, red, black. Red, red, but I've got that colour on. Oh no, red, red, black, and then the fourth line. Because that's 22k. Red, red, black again. Yeah, two hundred, two hundred and twenty ohms. So that would be that one. Just measure the last one, but this one should be 2.2k. Hmm. Well, I make that 22. I had to go to my backup stock of resistors. But there we are, 2.2k. So that's that one. Two point two. So that was a bit naughty, not having the right one. That's the first kit I've had, I think that's been missing an important part. Right, what we got left? That one. Oh, 
also read the instructions and it said something about you have to supply your own wire for the aerial, which goes just there. So I'll have to go and read the details again to see how long that piece of wire should be. Off switch. And finally this one, the microphone, which on there it shows a plus and a minus. Well, certainly a plus, but I've no idea which way round this should go. So we need a bit of wire for the aerial. I'm going to go and have a look at the diagram again, see if it tells me how long. I've had a look, it says 0.5 metres. So I've got some wire here. Measure that off at 0.5. So there's our aerial. I wonder if it works. Well, that was a complete fail. It didn't work. I tried replacing the resistor with the one that was supplied just in case the silk screen print was wrong and the resistors were right but that didn't make any difference so I desoldered the 9018 transistor and tried some random ones out of my box of bits here in doing that desoldering it and resoldering it a few times I actually damaged the track on the back so I've now got the transistor directly soldered on the back there and that is a 9013 transistor and we've got what I could best call a, um, a reasonable bit of success. It does actually work now, it's not very clear speech but it does work. So I'll go and demonstrate. The only radio I've got that's suitable is in the spare bedroom so we've got to go through there. It's over in the corner there, making a lot of static noise at the moment. Um, what's the best thing to do? best thing I can do is go and put the camera over there, so you can hear it. And I'll go the other side of the room. Well, I think we can say it's rubbish, but I did actually manage to hear myself talking, which was more than I could do to begin with. <laughs>